for utility's sake, there are some things that most of us people look at and jump straight onto really what I think the mass of humanity thinks. Like what? So we'll say, um, well, I'm not going to give a specific because we're well, no, I could give a specific. There was there was a time in the past where we were worried about uh, masks and things like that. Mm-hmm. And um, the awareness came, uh, had to bend from the expanded we, which was that there's no particle that's a virus that's infectious, for example. Mm-hmm. And uh, the singulars, us and the planet at the time, were like, don't say that that's crazy Mm -hmm. but it it ends up not being so crazy and Mm -hmm. in fact mm, true Mm -hmm. and so the the experience that we had as a group connected to um, you over the last few years wasn't the one that the mass amount of humanity fell for in a sense in the sense that we had the ability to see outside the envelope a little bit. Hey, look, this is more true. This is more true. Not this other thing that's actually not true. Mm-hmm. And from there, we can make choices about our life that were, I would say, high frequency, you know. Mm-hmm. So at a utility sake, that's valuable. And I can't tell you, you, whoever's listening you, how many times, how many things over the last decade or more that I've known you and the we and listened to what you have to say Mm -hmm. that even though it many times is like, no, it can't be, or no, really? Or no, I like that fantasy story that I thought was true. Can't tell you how many of those there were that having listened to you and investigate it because, you know, generally speaking, most of us like to hear a thing and then we'll go verify it. Yes. <laughs> right? Verify it with somebody. If somebody else says it too, then, then maybe it's true. It. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. But if you just say it, that's fine. But, you know, I need to go verify yeah, this verifies, stuff. Yeah, verify yes. So there yes. was a lot of that verifying going on. But it's turned out 99.9. I mean, I can't just 100% of the time. I mean, there's no reason for 99.9. <laughs> Leave us a little bit of room no, for No, there's... There hasn't misinterpretation. Been, <laughs> the only misinterpretations, if any, were on the hearing part, not the saying part. Yes, yeah, indeed. Yeah. That's true. So it gives a giant leg up on experiencing any and all of the things, especially, and not exclusively, but especially the things that you really have a very tenuous grasp on, like pre-births or in-between lives or near-death experience or or mm-hmm. fairies or elves or aliens or any of the things that you like we're only scratching at in a collective world yeah they generally have an answer that helps steer you into what actually is going on mm-hmm. and if you're able to listen and able to hear it then you're gonna get a big leg up on comprehending what's actually happening yes indeed. so that's where and what i see they bring to us in our conversations 